Paul Franklin. I play steel guitar with the Time Jumpers. And uh, I joined the band. I was actually a part-time jumper. I used to sub for John Huey, the late, great John Huey. And uh, I joined about seven years ago when he passed on. And, and, uh, and I've treasured every mo moment since. I remember my first check. Um, it was actually, uh, I'm from Detroit. So my, my father, I joined the Musicians Union. And, uh, and I didn't realize, you know, that, because I loved to play, it didn't matter, I would play for free. But uh, I did, uh, he joined me in the union, so I got called to do a session for Motown, and I got a check. And that was great. So I was, I was hooked from there on. But I've had a lot of uh, enjoyable moments. One that comes to mind, I would have to say, is because uh, we lost a lot of legends in the past few years. But I, I got booked on uh, the last George Jones and Merle Haggard duet record. And that was, you know, just, I mean, being a fly on the wall in that room, watching these two guys visit and, and love each other, it was, it was amazing. In music, it's really hard for me to say I have a favorite song, favorite artist, because I love so many uh, different styles of music. But uh, musicians, I can say this, we lost one of the greatest steel guitar players, that's my instrument, and uh, in Buddy Emmons this past year. He just went on, he did everything, but we lost him because, uh, and for me, I'd have to say on my instrument, he was my favorite. Uh, the instrumental All Aboard really happened because, uh, again, I joined the band at the Station Inn, and uh, when I joined the band, of course, I'm, I'm learning, I think they had like 70 songs to learn. So, I, uh, would get called, like they used to feature John, so they'd call a song, John had these songs worked out. I had nothing worked out with the band. So we talked about it, Kenny uh, had the idea, he said, man, I'd really like to get some of that Texas Troubadour sound, twin guitars. And they didn't really have anything like that. And uh, so anyway, Vince joins the band, you know, and I'm still thinking about what to do, so I, I submitted this song. And, and if you listen to this song and think about Count Basie or Ellington, that's what it is. It's, it's a big band, a call and res response. So you have, like in big bands, you'll have the trombones play, a few bars and the sax play. And so we have three guitars play a line and the fiddles answer. And it, it's, it works that way throughout, but it's really in the, in the spirit of the old big band swing. Mm -hmm. 